biggest problem an architect has is getting from the screen into physical space. How do I bring some of that virtual stuff and lock it to a physical model to give us a sense of scale, proportion, form, and space? Microsoft HoloLens is a wearable computer that lets you see holograms mixed with reality. It actually changes the way you think about design. I live here in Venice, California. I teach at UCLA in the old Howard Hughes hangar. We were asked by the American Pavilion at the Venice Biennale of Architecture to be imaginative and show what's coming with architecture. And we were given a mile-long building in Detroit that's been abandoned for 50 years to use our imaginations on. I'd known about the Trimble-Microsoft partnership on the HoloLens and was just itching to find the right project to do a pilot with it. So we built a model, but we used HoloLens to get us inside some of those spaces. I didn't know how big our site was compared to corporate headquarters or museums. With Trimble Connect, I can look up and grab different buildings to compare. We could just pull a model and duplicate it and see that it would take 12 Tate Moderns to fill the site. That brought it to life in terms of use. Microsoft HoloLens lets us get inside stuff earlier and experience it, and I can look up and see the volume that I'm in and start to make decisions about how to design it. Without a HoloLens, I would have been making those decisions three, four months from now. But with the HoloLens, I'm making those decisions at the moment of inception. In the redesign of the Packard plant, showing the dynamics is something that's very hard to do. HoloLens immediately solved that problem, and it explained why things were the way they were, because they were meant for vehicles and people to move around. I've spent my whole life trying to get things from geometry into the physical world. HoloLens is going to bridge that gap between the two-dimensional and the three-dimensional and physical space. And that's architecture. It's a revolution.